I'm allergic to tree nuts, peanuts, milk, eggs, and buckwheat. Bradley's milk allergy was very, very severe. Uh, before we started oral immunotherapy, it was not uncommon for him to end up in the emergency room because of allergic reactions. We were doing online research on potential um, you know, food allergy treatments um, and came across OIT as, as something that was an up and coming kind of treatment. Um, and at first, you know, I thought it might be too good to be true because um, we were wondering why more doctors weren't doing it um, if it worked you know, as advertised. Oral immunotherapy is a successful treatment for 85% of patients, and it was uh, also successful in Bradley's case. Bradley's case was particularly rewarding. It was rewarding because over the course of 10 to 12 months, we were able to desensitize him to milk and tolerate a normal serving size of milk. If we hadn't done OIT, um, every day that he goes to school, you'd kind of, in the back of your mind, just, just wonder if he'd come across um, you know, milk either in the cafeteria or, or snack time or something like that. And so, um, you know, not having to worry about that has been great um, since he completed OIT. Now I can eat pizza, ice cream, and popcorn. We had a lot of questions for Dr. Sagel when we first came in, um, and he was patient with us and answered all of those questions and really got us comfortable um, with the OIT process. Whether it was when we came in for appointments uh, every couple weeks or even just on the phone if we had a question at home, he always made himself available uh, you know, to, to help us feel comfortable. It's been particularly rewarding to help Bradley and his family. Milk allergy was such a challenging food for them to avoid and to be able to see him to interact with friends and family without fear of allergic reaction just from cross-contamination, not to end up in the emergency room, that's just fantastic for him.